According to the property of definite integration, if f of x is an even function, then, integral negative k to positive k, f of x dx equals 2 times integral 0 to k, f of x dx. The Gaussian function, e raised negative x square is an even function. To evaluate the Gaussian integral, i equals integral negative infinity to positive infinity e raised negative x square dx, initially use the property of definite integration. Thus, integral negative infinity to positive infinity, e raised negative x square, dx is equal to 2 times, integral 0 to infinity, e raised negative x square dx. Substitute x square equals u or x equals root u. Taking differential on both sides of x equals root u will give dx equals du by 2 root u. The limits of integration will not change when the variable x changes to root u. According to the definition of gamma function, integral 0 to infinity, e raised negative u u raised n minus 1 du is equal to gamma of n. Comparing integral 0 to infinity, e raised negative u, u raised n minus 1 du, with integral 0 to infinity, e raised negative u, u raised negative half du will give n equals half. The value of gamma of half is root pi.